why do I always procrastinate showering? I mean, it's 4 p.m. I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> Hi, guys. <coughs> <coughs> wow. Hi, guys. I wanted to say good morning, but then I realized it's 4.30 p.m. right now. My project group and I just handed in uh, the project online. Well, what is my hair doing? We just handed in the project online and everyone was being all emotional like this was the best project group ever. But honestly, it was. I wouldn't want to spend that week in Ko Chang 24-7 uh, with, with any other project group for sure. <laughs> yeah, I'm really happy we had to do two projects this term together. So yeah, I'm really glad we did that together. Now, actually, I want to edit, edit, edit because I'm so many vlogs behind. First, I'm gonna clean this room. I don't understand how it turns out like this every single day. I used to be so keen on keeping my room clean. It disappeared. And what is this white spot? I'm so annoyed by these pigment spots, but let's clean. So I haven't ripped off any pages of this thing since uh, April 11th. Next item, ripped clothes. I don't know if I ever told you that I ripped these pants at work. I think I did, uh, which was really awkward. This is not the first pair of, of jeans I ripped. I ripped one before this because I was twerking. Let me tell you, um, the day I had the lecture, like last week, I noticed that it was very thin there. And when I came home and took off my pants, there were freaking rips in my pants. Again. Are you freaking kidding me? And also, they're like two. Another broken item, which I didn't do myself and which I'm really mad about. It's just a black crop top, which I wear a lot. I wore it during New Year in Cambodia. And since you get wet and everything gets wet, I stepped into the shower with my clothes on. Of course, it got even wetter, but that's not important. I cleaned it under the shower with shampoo. I washed it. <laughs> and the next morning, we went to a different hotel. So I had to put my wet clothes in a bag in my suitcase. And then at that new hotel, I hung it above the shower. But apparently, when Martina grabbed my clothes because she wasn't wanted to take a shower, she did it like this. And there were apparently like 20 things in the shower, which you couldn't see. Unless you're like seven feet tall. And I, what the hell? There's a freaking hole in my freaking crop top. Like, why? You can see me. I can see you. So sad. Like I'm stepped in the chest. Why would you put like sticky things over there? It was like they were trying to keep away birds. I'm pretty sure there are no birds in your bathroom. A wasp. Is it in my shirt? No. A wasp is attacking me. I just want to eat cookies with chocolate. And that's a big ass humble bumble bumblebee. <laughs> 19 degrees Celsius. Woo! Go Holland. That's actually pretty cold if you ask me. But for some people, it's like an excuse to go wild and they wear shorts. 20 degrees Celsius, so I'll tell you how much it is in Fahrenheit. Fahrenheit sounds so German to me. 66 Fahrenheit. Wraps. Hi guys, um, my hair is really wild today. I just don't feel like doing it. <laughs> but uh, it's 1 p.m. right now and I already finished editing a vlog, which I started yesterday. So that's saving right now only two more percent so let's pray it saves i think it will will it though it's gonna be another editing day and exchange day and just nothing special at all 
Yay, it's saved. Okay. Also, I'm really craving a wrap right now or a burrito, whatever. I think I'm gonna make one as lunch. <laughs> I take that back. Apparently, my dad finished all the beef. So, no wrap for me. <laughs> but we do have Turkish bread, which is really nice. So, I think I'm gonna eat that with cheese and olives and yum, yum, yum. The video is uploaded and I'm still editing the thumbnail and then I have one vlog up and I still need like 15 more. Okay, that's an exaggeration, but at like 5 or something. I can't get you out of my frame, oh it's such a shame. Oh my god, look what just happened. I have an allergic reaction to something and now I turn blue. Just kidding, but... <laughs> I've been having this face mask on for way too long and I can barely move my mouth. This is so weird. I'm trying to make an intro for my vlog channel because I really, really, really want one, but I'm desperately in search for music. I can't really find something nice unless I'm thinking about the song uh, Remy uses, uh, Miss Remy Ashton or Rem Life, you know, the vacation song, but I don't want to copy her. So I found a instrumental of Fiesto and Natalie La Rose. They're both Dutch. Uh, the right song is it's called. I don't know if I like it. I like the song, but I don't know if I like it with this. I will update you. I think I just made an intro, which I honestly really like. The only thing I miss is something like this. I want to put in letters like uh, See Like Dio, a new vlog every week. But... Since I edit with Movie Maker, I cannot uh, put black lines around the letters, so if I put them in here, you cannot really read them. So I don't know what to do right now, but I, for now, it looks like this. I guess I think <laughs> uh, I'm not too sure yet but I will just save it for now and I'm not gonna use it right now because I'm not on track on my vlogs and I first want to be that before I put in like new vlog every week and then I don't upload I'm like six vlogs behind so for tomorrow I made a little to-do list by the way I don't think I ever mentioned this week that it's like May holiday which most schools have uh, most colleges most univer no universities don't have like any holidays I mean I go to it I cannot really explain the the, sis, the school system here in the Netherlands because it's different than I don't know from America and from England and stuff like that obviously um, but I go to college or University of Applied Sciences and there is like a level higher is the actual university I guess and they often only have Christmas break which sucks for them because we have like fall break um, carnival for like the southern part of part of the country May break I guess that's it we have a lot I feel like we have a lot of free days Maybe it's just this year. I feel like this year is more than last year, but I'm rambling and rambling. It's before 11 and I'm actually going to bed. Well, I'm going to watch TV in bed, but I'm actually going to bed, so be proud. My arm is hurting right now. <laughs> I will talk to you tomorrow again. Yeah. Good night. Hi guys, today it's the 4th of May, which means it's um, Dode Herdenking here in the Netherlands. Basically we remember all the victims of war and yeah, so it's a really thoughtful day I would say. And at 8pm uh, there's two minutes of silence in the entire country. Someone put up their Dutch flag. Tomorrow, the 5th of May, we celebrate uh, Bevrijdingsdag, which means Liberation Day. We celebrate the fact that we're free and there's no war here in the country. Uh, there are loads of festivals tomorrow, like Liberation Day festivals. And I'm actually going to a festival, but it's not a Liberation Day festival. It's a beach opening and um, the beach is obviously open like all the time, but uh, this more like the terraces and cafe. What the hell is that car doing? Okay, the car back that. What? Okay.
okay. The beaches are open, I believe, the whole year through, but uh, it's more like the beach season has started and the cafes are open on the beach and stuff like that. So there's like a festival on the beach somewhere. And tonight I'm actually going to my friend Whitney, which I'm going there with. Um, I'm going to sleep at her place because she lives closer and otherwise. I have to travel 2 hours and 40 minutes to get to her house. And if I would do that tomorrow morning, then uh, uh, just no. Oh, 2 minutes of silence are uh, happening in the train. So the trains are actually stopping. I just read that. I didn't even know that. Uh, yeah, I'm going there tonight and sleeping at her place. Going to the festival tomorrow then sleeping at her place again. And right now I'm going to a travel agency in my city because my family and I are most likely going to the United States of America on holiday which is really amazing <laughs> because I'm going there on exchange and I told my mom after I went to Thailand mom like wouldn't it be a good idea to go on holiday to <laughs> America since I don't like to be on airports alone she was like oh yeah I already thought about that and I already talked about it with my boss and stuff like that what <laughs> I'm in a bit of a rush. Uh, I just packed my suitcase. It looks like I'm going on holiday for three years. But oh well. It, uh. Why did I bring this toothpaste? I don't even like that one. Meanwhile, I'm cooking pasta. And that as well. <laughs> I'm making a pasta salad for dinner, lunch, early dinner. The only thing I've eaten today was breakfast. <laughs> Ugh. Oh, almost cut my finger. Small tomato. To have a good time. No! Who took the damn olives? Oh, there they are. Oh. <gasps> what happened to my shirt? Oh my god. I was just making my salad, minding my own business, when my shirt just... What the hell is this? It's red. That's not tomato. It looks like makeup, but I don't really wear red makeup. <laughs> okay, change of outfit. <laughs> Same blouse, different color. <laughs> yeah, and my beautiful salad. Let's go. Hi guys, it's Liberation Day, so let's celebrate our freedom. So, actually we're not going to a festival that's related to Liberation Day, but whatever. Um, yeah, I'm here at Whitney's place. I forgot to vlog yesterday. We just got ready, showered and everything. I have a small problem. My tights don't fit. I wanted to show you, but then I realized that I'm in my underwear. I'm just gonna deal with these really, really, really tight tights. That what a struggle. Yeah, I'm not gonna bring this camera because it's too big. What the hell? I'm only wearing one flip-flop and I didn't even notice. <laughs> I'm gonna flip film clips on my phone though. Hopefully it works out. Oh, can you see my butt in the mirror? <laughs> we didn't make the bus, so we're taking the bike and then the train. Ladies and gentlemen, official opening! Guest room 
sister. So yeah, <laughs> she doesn't have to deal with me. Um, yeah, it was a really, really great day and the weather was amazing. Like the first official day, I guess, in the Netherlands where you could really go without jacket. <laughs> it was really nice. And I'm going to sleep now, so I will see you tomorrow. Hi guys, it's Friday now and today I traveled home from Whitney's house. So I traveled for about two hours and 40 minutes, which is uh, so long. Uh, it's five now, I've been home for like one and a half hours now. I've just been sitting outside since the weather is really, really, really nice, like you go the Netherlands. <laughs> the thing is, I always get really tired after traveling. Traveling, it sounds like I took a plane or something. In those two and a half hours, I could literally go to England, I could go to Macedonia by plane and stuff, so that's kind of depressing. <laughs> I wanted to do a lot for exchange and for our holiday, but uh, I just, oh, I just can't. <laughs> so I'm gonna lay on the couch and watch Pretty Little Liars episode since I'm still in like season four or something. So let's do that. Hi guys, what do you think of the palm tree on my head? <laughs> looks crazy. Today it's like 27 degrees something, 25 and everyone is freaking out because the Netherlands what are you doing? I mean that's summer, literally summer and everyone is freaking out because <laughs> I see a lot of people in shorts and cycling and basically being naked and it's just fun. <laughs> I'm sitting outside, I'm going to do the things for exchange again. Great. 10 minutes to get ready and I don't even have pants on yet. I'm going to work and this weather is gonna make it either extremely busy or not at all because people are either gonna take Chinese food when it's warm or they're gonna barbecue so we'll see what happens like I said uh, when it's really nice weather, it's either super busy or not at all. And it was the second thing, which I don't like. I like it busy because then you're just doing stuff all the time. Time is going faster and often you work longer, so it means more money. <laughs> but yeah, it was kind of not busy at all. <laughs> My mom and I just had a dance battle. And you can tell because I sound like that. <laughs> Love my asthma. Good night. Hi guys, it's Mother's Day today, which is a horrible day because, let me explain, <laughs> I don't hear my mom. Um, Mother's Day and Father's Day are the worst days uh, to go to work because it's extremely busy. And when I say extremely busy, whenever you get takeout food at our restaurant, the restaurant where I work at, you can either call or you can go there and order there. Last year, uh, the, the waiting uh, time on the phone was one and a half hours. So if you would ask, so okay, when can I get my food? One and a half hours later. That's ridiculous. Mother's Day and Father's Day. <laughs> I hate them. But like I said yesterday, the weather can either make it extremely busy or extreme, extremely quiet. So we'll see. I'm gonna sit outside for a while, just enjoy, enjoy, enjoy the sun for a little bit before I have to go to freaking war. I just sat in the sun for a while and sorry my Spotify is talking <laughs> uh, yeah and now I'm going to work so let's see if it's gonna be horror or chill hi I'm back and the first thing I do when I come back from work is take off these damn pants because they're way too tight I can't breathe <sighs> it's been a while since I packed a suitcase for a week uh, since I'm going to back to Breda tomorrow to my uh, other room where I live during the week with my roommates. I'm not sure if I can do this. <laughs> I think I'm giving up. My suitcase is so full and all of this crap still needs to be go in there. But 
I'm gonna fill this bag as well. Well, at least I tried, and I will see tomorrow if this is gonna work out. Probably not. So tomorrow the break of one week, the May break, is officially over and I'm going back to school and it's gonna be fun to see everyone again. Actually pretty excited, believe it or not. <laughs> but yeah, it's 11 something right now. I'm just gonna watch TV for a little bit and my alarm goes off at 6.30, so that sucks. But yeah, we'll see you tomorrow with a new vlog. Good night.